Greetings friend, entrepreneur, and fellow business builder. I'm marketing master Jim Ackerman, and this is your 30 Second Marketers Tip of the Day. You know, over the last several tips, we've spent a lot of time talking about features and benefits and their relative role in the sales process. We've talked about the kinds of features and the kinds of benefits, but we haven't talked yet about how to write your copy in benefit language, and that's what we want to talk about today. You know, most people are so familiar with the features of their products or services that they write about the features and never say anything about the benefits. Better marketers write about the features and then add in the benefits, but the best marketers lead with the benefits and support those benefits with the features, and that's what you should be doing. If you say these wonderful dietary supplements are in a brown bottle, so that they stay fresh and effective, that is a feature so that benefit statement, okay? What would happen if you just flip-flop the two of those and said, your supplements will stay fresher longer because they're bottled in a brown glass bottle? That's leading with the cognitive benefit and backing that benefit up with the feature that allows you to believe the cognitive benefit is true. What if we took it to the next level and said, you will feel more energetic and happy through the course of the day because these supplements are bottled in a brown glass bottle to keep them fresher longer, okay? We have led with an emotional benefit about your feelings backed it up with a feature, and then further justified it with another cognitive benefit at the end. That's a technique for writing in benefit language, and that's also your marketing tip of the day.